Guys, welcome back to a brand new Disney Heroes Batman video. So I hope you're all having a fantastic day. And I, I keep getting a lot of questions recently about my arena team and why I use the characters that I use and why I have my backup ones. So I basically wanted to dive in because last week I, I did a video on arena, but I never particularly covered why I use the team and kind of my strategies here, guys. So... I'm in um, Challenger V, which which is okay. I haven't done hugely well in this um, Challenger section, but I've got six keys, and I want to jump in and explain to you what teams I aim for and how I counter and how I kind of do the process of attacking people. So let me go on to my defense so you can see my team. So the team I'm using at the moment, and it's the same team as I normally use, guys, is we have Alt... For doing mad insane amounts of damage he just sits at the back and chills we've got zeus who will basically kill everybody before the round even starts as you guys well know he's absolutely mental and then i've got sisu here who's i'm very slowly and very patiently trying to work on her friendship disc at the moment so i can lower the reflect damage which means she's going to be like a better version of tron because I can nuke all of the reflect damage that comes from Ian, which is obviously Zeus's biggest issue. So that's going to make Sisu really good as a counter there, guys. And Ariel for healing, plus her disc pushes up max HP and then heals over health as well. And then Rhea for another nuke character. When I say nuke character, it just means bang, nuke, everybody's dead. So we've kind of got Zeus and Rhea for damage. Sisu to keep Zeus alive when they verse Ian aerial to keep everyone else alive so that's kind of my strategy there so i know for a fact right so i did a few battles yesterday that i could quite easily kill all these now this one's on 67 million power which is 20 million above mine but this team does not have this is not a good link at all in this team like none of these characters here particularly link very well with each other so i'm curious to see this one so if i jump in here take mr big off put bolt on Right, and I'll use that main team just so you can see. I'll take off the speed up as well. So you can see what happens here. I might get absolutely flattened, but I shouldn't. So the lightning. There we go. Killed everyone straight away. And then Bolt finishes off the last ones. Boom. So that is why that's the only team there. 20 million power above me. And I still flatten them. So let's fight it again. Just so you can watch again and see what happens. So obviously what's nice is they come in. Sisu gives everybody a shield. Zeus nukes everybody, Zeus nukes everybody, Bolt finishes them off. So the shield there is really important, and that's also going to help deflect that reflect damage as well when it comes in. So what I mean by that is, guys, if I show you Sisu here, and it really does make Sisu a fantastic character. So you can obviously see that I've got all of my main characters on 285 at the moment, and yesterday, guys, I brought Kermit up to 285, just so you guys are aware of what I'm, who I'm working on. So I'm currently trying to push Sisu's friendship mission which means I need to upgrade Mushu a little bit. So I don't even know where he's gone. Because I... Oh, there he is. So if, if I just keep kind of slowly bringing him up, guys, as you know I've been doing for a while. Uh, free... I'm going to get enough to do that. Let, let's promote him up, and then I can try the friendship mission again. Um... There we go. So I brought his skills up to 20 more levels and I put, promoted him a little bit there as well, guys. Not much more I can do, unfortunately. So I'm trying to bring him up quite slowly. Just so. Um, I think I was, I was also trying to just run through these missions here as well. Just so I could get a disc to use. Just to help a little bit. Yeah, because here we go. I can get two stars here, yeah. They can absolutely, if you get it in the right thing, you can absolutely trigger it. Right, so let's get his badge of two stars here, guys. That's just going to help with Sisu's mission. Claim that there. Lovely. And then I can promote his disc up to two there. I can also get it up to three as well. Um, but that's fine for now. Okay, so that's put that in a good position. So now let's see if we can go back into Sisu's mission and get hers. Because she's such a must for boss battles, guys. And this is what I mean. So obviously she's got 
Um, she has got the disc equipped at the moment. But here, skill power. Reality to anyone when they're shielded. Armor to eyes when they're shielded. They're always going to be more or less shielded, especially when you're using aerial and Sisu. So Sisu and our allies take 18% reduced damage from reflect. So I think you can probably get that up to like 35, 50 odd. Um, yeah, so let's push this friendship mission a little bit more and see if we can actually progress. Now I've tripped them up a little bit more. Let's take it off of auto actually. Let's try and get the shield on straight away here. There we go. I can't remember why I couldn't complete this one. How do we kill this guy? What? Oh wait, I think I remember now. I remember this this just being glitched out because you can't actually kill that guy. So I I, I know what I'm gonna have to do here. Let's do it. Let's max him out. Because at the end of the day, guys, um, what I'm going to want to do with him at max levels, because I, I want to upgrade. Um, so there we go. I actually didn't. Oh, I did have enough money. Nearly had enough money. I'm going to want to upgrade him anyway. He's actually quite a cool character. Plus now that means when I unlock her disc, it means that I can get it maxed out, which means when, when they're shielded enemies, guys, we're going to be able to ridiculously level them up and of course area and Sisu are both shielding so okay they're maxed out now still not particularly changed much of the tide of the battle here but just did he just did a million damage in one fireball there I don't know what I'm missing. Maybe when the time runs out, it will let me go past like they do with Beast. Wait, someone did do some damage then. I'm not sure how. Because <laughs> it doesn't let me look into that guy. So I, I can't see how I'm damaging him. I might try and level up uh, uh, Mushu actually a bit more. I might try and get him to yellow 8 because he's quite good actually. So he's, he's been silenced. Oh, so when he does the normal spit, it's doing damage. So he's got one move. Which he never seems to use, which does damage. I love his little move. Okay, this is obviously a glitched mission, guys. So it was the big fireball that he shot out, which did some damage. So if I jump into this and see what that actually was. Um, let's have a look, shall we? He shot out one big fireball for some reason. Oh, that's actually really good. Removes all the debuffs. I didn't realize he had that. Size enemies 12 seconds. That's the one that, that's his normal attack. I didn't realize. 
That he was such a good um, silencing character. I don't know how I'm supposed to get through that. So, I'm, I'm going to drop that out to you guys here. Is this mission glitched? Or am I just doing something horrendously wrong? That's what I want to know, guys. So, please comment down below and let me know what I'm doing wrong. Because um, I generally do want to know. Because something doesn't seem right about that mission. I was able to only damage him a very, very small amount. And even then, it didn't really do anything. So, I want you guys to comment down and let me know what was wrong. I know I kind of took a giant tangent on this video because I was initially talking about the PvP stuff. But, you know, most of you who watch me guys know that I just generally just waffle on and just enjoy myself playing this game. So, I'm curious to see what you guys think. And, you know, what was being done wrong there? Win with no tank roll ally. Oh, this is going to be an easy one. I'm going to put... Ah, oh, Slinky's technically a tank. Um... By all the top characters tanks. I put dash on. Thirty two million in one battle, guys. So again, I hope you saw Oh, I need to get another mercenary. Can I can I get a yes. Easiest way to do it. Another 28 million. So guys, that's why it's important to do those mercenary bits. But anyway guys, I will see you legends all in the next one. Kind of this, this video kind of went rapidly downhill guys. And um, yeah, what am I doing wrong on that CC level? I'm asking you guys for advice here. I'm putting it out in general. I need your advice for a change. What am I doing wrong? And how can I counter react that CC level? Yes, I know I might need to get... Mushu up to yellow 8, which I'm going to work on now. I'm going to put all of my stamina and energy into Sisu at all times, guys, to really bring him up as high as I can. So that's going to be my main focus. So, yeah. Everything that I've got is going to go into Sisu now. But I just don't know what I'm doing wrong or how I can get around completing that mission because I need to get that friendship disc desperately for Sisu because it's really going to bring her up just to that next level but yeah anyway guys i'll see all you legends in the next one